Hey, Mother Truckers, no joke here. 13 hours ago, I actually pulled a survey from all the truck drivers on Mother Trucker News, and over 3,100 truck drivers and counting did the survey. It said, question of the day, should rental box trucks be allowed to park at the truck stop parking lots? So from 3,100 votes, uh, there was two options. One was, yes, I don't mind, and no, it's for semi-trucks. So, yes, I don't mind. 35% of truck drivers said they actually didn't care at all. But over 65% said that no, it's for semi-trucks, and they did care. Right? Let's get into some of the comments on this right here, and then we'll get into today's video. So, a mother trucker says, if they face the same discrimination we do, I wouldn't care. Another subscriber says a box trucks and bobtails need their own area at the truck stops. Do you agree with that? Yes or no? He writes, box trucks don't bother me as bad as bobtails in trailer spots. Interesting. Another subscriber says, wow, I thought this only pissed me off. These truck stops need to fix those issues. More shots fired. Uh, best is when you find a hot shot guy with his little trailer disconnected in one spot and his pickup taking up another. Ooh. For the hot shot drivers that watch the show, what are your thoughts about that? Do you believe that you should be able to park at the truck stops? Now, you know, hot shot drivers, they do go over the road. So for the ones that do, where else could they park? What's going on, Mud Truckers? Uh, this is a good uh, question of the day. Tell me how you feel about this right here. So, you know, uh, a driver was upset and said, Alex, you know, there's no truck parking at a truck stop. There barely is. You know, people always got to park on the side and things like that. But he says the thing that really upsets him is when you see something like this right there, like a Ryder or a Penske or U-Haul small box truck. Uh, parks in the truck parking lot you know he says it should be reserved just for truck drivers you know uh, what what are your true thoughts about that right um, you know I'm not here to hate on this man or anything like that no honestly I don't want people to get bad about this but I truly believe that you know uh, RVs uh, small box trucks you know hey you know, there, there's a place for them to park and they can park at a lot of places so when there's not a lot of uh, spots for truck drivers to park at night, then, you know, this right here at, at the truck stop should just be for truck drivers. Man, I hope I don't piss people off, but that's just kind of how I feel about that. Uh, my truckers, comment down below. What are your thoughts about it? But yeah, those are my two cents to it. You know, as a small box truck, uh, you have a lot of options when truck drivers do not. So yeah, and that goes for RVs as well, right? And so. You know, uh, tell me, am I being harsh on this? But I do agree with uh, this truck driver uh, about, you know, small box trucks parking in uh, truck parking spots at truck stops. Oh. Hey, what's up, bro? How's life? I live here now. I just moved here. Yeah, man. You know, I'm just hanging. Look at this. What's the advice for people that want to do tanker, man? Anything? No, I mean, be careful, but it's good, good one. You know, I had a small question of the day. It's not going to get anyone in trouble. But uh, some uh, uh, some people were asking me, question of the day, Alex, uh, how do you feel about small box trucks parking in the truck parking lot? Oh, that's a hassle, man. That's you know, because I saw a couple here. Yeah. And then... The, Bob yeah. Bob they park. They shouldn't park double on one side, on you, one spot up. Yeah, save it up, right? Yeah. So that's how I feel too. No RVs, no RVs. And, and no small box trucks. No. Leave it for the truck drivers, right? Yep. Yeah, I feel All the right, same man. way, man. Nice hey, beautiful day. truck, man. Nice yeah. Day. Have a good day. That's awesome. Well, there's another truck driver that agrees, folks. So, you know. I'm telling you, I, I think this is my way of losing weight. Every morning, I'm going to go to a, a, a close local truck stop and just walk around for about 20 laps. Hopefully not get hit by a semi-truck, right? <laughs> but let me switch this up. He did make a good point right there, right? About even uh, Bobtail, you know, uh, should Bobtail trucks 
park two trucks in deep, right? And I know sometimes you don't want to go up to another driver and the communication with that, but what, what are your thoughts about that? You know, save the space, help a driver out, right? You know, um, that's a good one. That's a good one. There are truck drivers that weren't able to park in a, a truck parking spot because, you know, a box truck ticket spot, right? And so, mother truckers, you know, what are your thoughts about that? Uh, definitely not trying to shame anybody, but yeah, I'm going to take a stand on this. You guys say I don't take a stand on things enough. Uh, definitely uh, box trucks, you know, park in the front somewhere, right? But, you know, this right here should be reserved for truck drivers.